Today I've got the Micro Galaxy Squadrons ATTE finally, and to be honest with you guys, I didn't know if I was going to be able to get this one, but shout out to my buddy Ryan, he was able to find this and pick it up for me. Here's a look at the box. I am just super excited to look at this. Look at all these clones it comes with. We're going to open this box and get right into this opening. And also, uh, this is the first Micro Galaxy Squadron I've ever seen to come with zip ties. It's kind of, I don't know if that's nice just to keep it in place, but we're going to go ahead and cut those off here. Alright, let's take the figures here and take a look. So we've got Captain Rex, we've got a clone pilot, and three normal Phase 1 clones. So you're going to be able to put all these guys into this tank. And here's a closer look. Uh, lots of weathering. Oh, this thing is actually pretty, pretty flimsy. Like, uh, very flexible. I was not expecting that. So, when I got this thing out of the box, I'm not gonna lie, it takes a very long time to get this thing posed where all the feet are flat. But, eventually, we got there. And this thing looks great, and I know on the end of the cannon I did forget to take that piece off, but uh, let's go ahead and take a closer look. The weathering and paneling on this ship is really, really good. And as you can see, the ball turrets on the front, those are all articulated. Those are all able to move. And the main cannon on the top is on a complete 360 swivel, which that's pretty nice that it does an entire 360. And of course you have two more turrets on the back. These also move, but they actually don't move as much as the ones on the front. They don't go that high at all, but they are still poseable. And the back plate does come off to reveal some storage. So you do have some seats for the two gunners, but you also have an area for this included speeder. Now, uh, my speeder <laughs> came pretty warped uh, in this one. I'm not going to lie. I mean, look at that thing. It's almost a Z. But we'll try to bend it back and we'll show you guys what it looks like once you store these speeders in the back of the ATTE. So you just match up the peg with the hole and it just slides right on and there you have it and it holds two uh, so that's also an added feature um, and of course I'll go ahead and put one of my clone guys back here in the gunner seat get him ready to take on the CIS and these panels come off to reveal three more seats on each side totaling six more seats for your clone troopers And the panels do just snap back on, which is very nice. I didn't have any problems getting those back on. And the turret moves up so that you can pull down the cockpit to where we can go ahead and put this clone gunner right in his seat here. And we're going to go ahead and throw Captain Rex in here as well. I also believe this is the first time we're getting Captain Rex um, in a set. He was a Micro Galaxy mystery box before, but now he is in an actual ship set, which is nice to have. We're going to go ahead and set him on the top seat there and close him back up. And you can see it from the inside, which is also nice. And we're going to go ahead and put that last clone in the back gunner spot as well. Just to put him somewhere, we'll put all these clones. Just showing you guys you can fit everything you get with this set inside of it. And yeah, I mean, this thing looks really nice. While I put this clone in the turret spot, I will say the coloration is a little odd to me. Just maybe how drastic the panels are, just the much more gray and white. But besides that, I mean, it's one of my favorites that we've gotten the detail on the the dirt on the feet uh, looks like it was on geonosis maybe but it does look really good i want a couple of these and i'm really really hoping that maybe we get the gunship 
the LAAT versions that carry these around. That would be super cool. If you guys like this, let me know in the comments below. And what is the next Micro Galaxy Squadron ship you hope they make? Make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next review.